bring into life uh, two books that the fans are, are ravenous for uh, is is just extraordinary. And it's not something that a lot of people, whether it's a producer or writer or director or, or cast, ever get to do in their entire careers. Uh, so to be able to do it, not with just one movie, but now with, with three different movies, it being a trilogy, is it's extremely rewarding and and satisfying in a way that it's hard to explain. One of the biggest challenges is definitely opening up the uh, the movie so it goes beyond just the readers because, I mean, we all know that most of the readers are, are females and females don't go to the movies just with other females. They take dates. And so we want to make it interesting for their dates as well or other people that they, that they go with who may not have read the books. Some people read the first book and haven't read the second or third book. Um, so we want it to be just as enjoyable for people that have read the book and meet their expectations, but also for the people that haven't read the book and that they can still enjoy the film and understand and keep up with the story even though they haven't read the book. One of the great pleasures uh, is getting to see this ensemble cast come back together um, and grow as characters, but also even as people from seeing them from two years ago and seeing them get bigger parts in these films um, and the interaction between both them as a character and them as people on set um, has been uh, phenomenal. Uh, one of my favorite scenes is when they're on the jet and they surprise uh, Anna when she comes on uh, and Christian has them there to go to go with them. Um, I think that was one of the first times that we had them all together and to see everybody back and their roles start to really branch out.